Okay, this is Dragon of Eternity, and welcome back to World of Warcraft Shadowlands. Now, in the last episode, I went through the Phaestus Genesis of Aeons chapter in the Kyrian campaign. And in this video, I'll be going through the Righteous Retribution chapter in the Kyrian campaign. Now let's take a quick look at the Renown. In order to unlock this chapter, you need to have done the previous chapters. And you need to be Renown rank 11. So if you're Renown rank 11 and you've done the previous chapters, you will get the starting quest from Polymark Adrestes. So, let's start this off, shall we? An unexpected visitor, or unexpected visitor. Okay, I guess we were expecting someone. One Alexandros Mograine of Maldraxxus is meeting with the Paragon of Courage in Archon's Rise. Sandria has requested you join them. The two worked together recently to repel a nascent secondary assault on the Temple of Courage. Sandria seems to trust him well enough, so we have granted him access to the hold for now. I suspect they will not stay here long. You should make haste. Speak of Xandria and Archon's Rise. So, is this a chapter of... Am I in Archon's Rise? I guess I am. I will honor our accord. Gormor will fall by our combined might. Okay, I'm going to assume there's a part of the story I missed since I haven't done the Necrolord Covenant chapters. What's up, Alexandros? Orders. Maybe I should switch back to the Ashbringer. <laughs> Tell you what. Real quick. Uh, no, I want to keep my current gear on. I do, however, want to change out my sword. To that one. Lovely. Now we're matching. <laughs> Okie doke. So I guess there's a section of the Necrolord story that I'm missing here. An expected visitor. I'll tell you what, I'll pick this up first. Ooh, a purple. Alright, an expected visitor. Good. Now we can begin the mission. Al. A perilous journey. Morgraine has rallied the House of the Chosen to strike at Margrave Garmel and his House of Constructs. So I guess by this time you've already sorted out the House of the Chosen stuff. Alright. So rallied the House of Chosen to strike at Margrave Garmel and his House of Constructs. They grow in strength with each passing day. This may be our only chance. We will join them on the field of battle. We will have justice for the fallen at my temple, as well as Morgraine's own fallen kin. Rendezvous at Spider's Watch within Maldraxxus's northern reaches. We will move from there. Please tell me I have a teleport. Meet Zandria at Spider's Watch in Maldraxxus. We shall see soon enough. Can I have a teleport? Can I go through here, please? Oh, really? 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 <sighs> you know, I don't often make cuts in a video. Peace be upon you. But for this travel section, I'm willing to make an exception. We will not so I'm going to cut this flight to when I get to Xandria at Spider's Watch. So I'll see you in a few seconds. We will stand by you to the end, my paragon. Okay, about five minutes later, I'm finally here. So let's see. Oh. Oh. And you're the blind guy. And one of the owls got the tongue cut out. Oh god, yeah, I'm remembering the storyline. Okay. Okay. Righteous retribution, then. Now we can join our new allies. Together, stronger together. We are to meet Baroness Draca aboard the Zerichris, above this position. 
trust our allies' judgement in the battle ahead. True courage is knowing when to rely on the wisdom of others. The plan is simple. Clear out our flanks to ensure Carmel's forces do not interfere with our true goal. Then assault the Margrave himself. If we fail, we fail in the name of justice. Fly Zandria into the Necropolis Zerikis. Or Zerikis. I'm gonna guess it's that right there. Alright. The I'm gonna assume as part of Necrolord Covenant, which I haven't done yet, you courage. get a Necropolis. We will strike the eastern flank, and they the west. Then we shall converge on Garmal as one. Okay. Does there have to be slime seeping out? Just wondering. Alright, there's Draka. There's Mograine. We're all here. We must move now before the enemy can mount a proper defense. You are speaking to a princess. And I'm guessing you're someone I will eventually meet in the Maldraxxus Covenant campaign. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Alright, sub Draka. Welcome to Zeri Chris, a more walker. Fight and flight. Alexandros and Emene will lead to the chosen assault on the western gate. You and Xandria will direct your forces at the eastern gate. Secure the area and eliminate any resistance. Once both flanks are secured, we can attack Garmel directly. Fly with Xandria to the House of Constructs. We have our orders. So, <laughs> Fight well, Kyrian of Bastion. So let me get this straight. I had a quest to fly to the flight point in this zone. And then I had a quest to fly into here, hand that in, and now we have a quest to fly back out. I feel like a couple of these steps could be skipped easily. You know, have a portal into here. Ay, ay, ay. So, Easton. Oh, and is that Colossus going to help us out? You know, the one we rescued? What are those monstrosities? They're blue. Thank the Archon, they are not yet active. Bile Blood Juggernaut. Yeah, those are the corpses of your fallen brethren fused into monstrosities. Kind of gross. Kind of gross. Uh huh. I was gonna say, why do you have two sets of wings? Or was that from me? Or oh, Dan's in the. You have my attention. Fight and flight. This place is filled with horrors. Horrors we will purge. Just as from above, our forces above cannot fully descend upon this area while the Margrave's crystals cover the sky in destructive blasts. The Margrave's foul butchers work even now to extract the remaining anima from the Kyrian they abducted in the assault on Bastion. We must advance at once. I shall imbue you with the flames of courage, so that you may mark the crystals. Once marked, I will destroy them from afar. Destroy five Maldrasite cores. All right. Above. May the flames of courage Any requests? Yes. Apollon. Apollon, Apollon. Do you have need of my the Butchers of Bastion. Did these fiends show my kin mercy when they attacked Bastion? When they tore my brothers and sisters limb from limb and used them to create more of these... these things? No. The Butchers of Bastion made clear the hearts that day. They deserve only the eternal darkness that awaits them. Ensure they see it. Kill 10 has construct forces in the separation chamber. Take heart, hold Any requests while I'm here? Do you want a coffee? No? Okay. Okie dokie. 
Okie dokie. I feel like there would have been a third quest somewhere. Yeah, there is, right there. Ah, <laughs> oh, speak of it and it shall appear. Alright, what's this? Tatted scroll. The torn design document appears to be written by the late Surgeon Stitchflesh. Wasn't that the guy I killed in the dungeon? Probably. The Kyrian flesh improves strength, obedience, and dexterity twofold. Such potential. Now, if subject number 135 succeeds in a proper wing transplant at last, it continues on for some time. You should bring us to Artemed. Artemedi? Bring me a barn design to Artemedi outside the whole chains. Okay. So you're telling me that they're about to create wing monstrosities? Because that would really suck. Well, let's see if this goes into a new quest. Right then, allow me to read this for a moment. Are you done? Are you reading it? Anything? Anything happening? No. Okay. Okie dokie. I guess that will be continued at a later point. Maybe. Let's see, Maniac Confuser, I need to kill ten of you. Whoa. That was a lag spike. That was a really big lag spike. Huh. Hopefully nothing's... God, I'm just afraid of any video not being able to render properly after the issues I've had this these past few months. Uh-huh. So many issues. I'm glad uh, chapter 3 of this uh, Covenant campaign didn't have those render issues because that beast of a video took 5 hours to render. Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, I suppose I should probably make an addend and an and a correction. I was gonna say like an addendment, whatever you call it. I should probably make a correction from chapter three. There is a way for me to record other Covenant campaign chapters on a level sixty character. It does mean abandoning said Covenant now and going to a new one, which. I'd rather not do. Yeah, I'd rather not do that. Oh, well, you died. Uh-huh. That one died. I feel like I can increase my DPS here. Okay, so use you. Use you. Use power sharpening stone. And we're good. Okay, a little bit extra DPS. Yeah, I should probably go up here. Alright, I gotta kill five things. Lovely. And ba boom, ma boom, and there's a lot of people in the house. I best go before that hunter comes. God, you can tame the dragons. I should really get onto that with my hunter. Oh, I haven't played hunter in a while. I should probably get used to it again since I plan to use that in the Odin Wheel campaign. Uh huh. I would use a druid, but I'm still leveling that from low level to 50. How do I get to you? Okay, I gotta just blend round. Oh well. And let's kill you, and kill you on the way back. And we'll be good. Lovely. Yeah, I'm hoping to do a different class per per covenant, which should hopefully spice up the gameplay a bit. Hopefully, because I've been doing all these videos on Red Paladin. Well, apart from one side quest video where I played my Death Knight. Yeah. Okay, so hand these two in, and then hopefully. Artemidi says something. 
Alright, the butchers are past you, and all this bloodshed will not bring them back, but it may spare others the same fate. Uh huh. Keep down yourself there, buddy. It's not vengeance, it's justice! Welcome, brave. Ay, ay, ay. Just as from above, you have done a great service here. Well, wait. Descended. And now you have a quest. Though we have stopped the creation of more juggernauts, one of their most vile creations yet draws breath. It was born of one of the most pained souls they took from my temple. As I flew above their ranks, I could hear their surgeons chanting its name above the din of combat. Woeblade. It is an affront to all the Kyrians stand for, and a trustee beyond any other. Mark it with the flames of courage when you engage, and we will help you destroy it. Slay the Woeblade of, of Atrocity. And for that I will get a waste. Lovely. So Woeblade attained an amalgamation of the disciplines of courage. Okie dokie. So let's see, Artemide. Oh, there's another quest there too. Burn before reading. The scroll you recover details all manner of horrific ways to integrate fallen Kyrian into Gormel's abomination constructs. It is also incomplete. There must be more of these among Stitch Flesh's remaining followers. I saw a number of surgeons and their lackeys retreat into the Hall of Chains just ahead as we arrived. I suspect they hold more of these scrolls. We must ensure they are never read again. Collect six designs. Alright, can I check this real quick? Let's see, let's see, let's see. An uh, aquatic wake. Yeah, it was Surgeon Stitch, Stitch Flesh, which we fought. Okay. So let's see, an early end. Within the Hall of Chains lie more abominations that are nearly complete. As we speak, the Margrave's horses work fervently to graft the last pieces of flesh to their horrific visages. If they are allowed to finish their work, the constructs we have destroyed so far will mean little in the final conflict. Our flank will be overrun by a fresh wave of horrors, and the day will be lost. That must not come to pass. Destroy any abominations you come across. Destroy six inert butchers. Alright, so I'm not going back down there then. So, destroy six things, collect six things from enemies, I assume? And kill a big guy. Use the button on the big guy. Okay. Okay, okay. So it's just finding where said big guy is. I feel like there should be enemies in here. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. This feels a bit easy. <laughs> and boom. Ah, that ain't. There we go. There, there is. They're spawning. There they are. And okay, it's not a hundred percent chance of that dropping. Ah, lovely. <sighs> ah, yeah, you've got the wings of the Kyrian. Okay. Flames of Courage. See a world blade with eternal fire, increasing the crit strike chance of attacks against a target by 30% and calling Kyrian allies to aid you. Okie dokie. Uh -oh. Don't worry, hun, I'll put your soul out of its misery. Hopefully. And boom. Belch organs. Oh, that sounds disgusting. Can I use this again? That was depressing. It was clearly part of its soul I was fighting back, but we killed it before it had a chance to escape. I assume, maybe. Let's see, six designs. There's one. Stitch flesh design. Sewing in instructions for constructions made from Kyrian flesh. So, five of those to collect, and we're good. Lovely. Time to find five. Okay, that's two. Please drop one. Okay, there's people there. Okay, that's two out of six. 
Can I use this on you? No, it's only effective on Roblade. Yeah, well. I feel wind outside. Is not my dog trying to get in? No, not yet. Hmm. Yeah, I suspect the episode will be interrupted by him eventually. Okay, so you guys didn't drop anything. How about you three? Can I have a drop? Please. Free would be fantastic. And survey says two. Okay, I'll take two. Okay, how about you? And boom. I should probably heal. And boom. There we go. All done. I was expecting the drop rate to be more shitty. Well, it's it's a happy surprise that one. Well, let's see. And then to you. Any more dialogue from you two? No? Okay. Burn before reading, this foul work must be destroyed. Well done, I will see that these are destroyed personally. I hope you do destroy them instead of using them. Let's see, Apollon. In the end, every abomination denied is one less foe to contend with when we face Gormel. Okay. Descended. May our victory bring them peace. And I guess, let's see, I'm using the... Yeah, I'm using this one so I can upgrade that to 171 when I'm done with the storyline. Lovely. Alright, I'll just keep that here with the rest of the Kyrian gear. Right then. Kinfia. Trouble on the Western Front. Alexandros and our Maldraxi allies need reinforcements at the Western Gate on the Margrave's opposite flank. They are barely holding on. Our forces will reinforce our position. Here and push forward towards Gormel. We must make haste to Mograine. Without both flanks, we cannot hope to achieve victory. Fly with Kinfia to report to Alexandros at the Stitchyard. Can you fly me to the Western Gates? So you're gonna pick me up? There we go. So it's gonna be over here with all of the weird color pools, ain't it? What's it gonna be here? Hmm. Oh. 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 Okay. Sup, Mograine? Trouble on the Western Front. I'm glad Kinfia found you so quickly. Charging the blade. We can't advance with those juggernauts bombarding our position. I let a strike against the nearest, but conventional weapons do nothing against their imbued hides. Thankfully, I have an idea. Your old rune blade can't deal with them as it stands. But if you could purge Gormel's empowered masses and absorb their essence into the blade. Charge your rune blade by killing enemy constructs in the stitch yard. Alright, I guess we're using that again. Sup, Vosh? I don't, think I've, I don't think I've killed you on this character yet. Grave intent. My spies have identified several astral projectors that Margrave Garmel uses to rally his troops in the stitch yard. I do not wish for a swarm of frenzied constructs to descend upon us during the final confrontation. Surely you see the wisdom in cutting their fur. See to it that these projectors are destroyed. We believe them to be along the yard's perimeter. Destroy the southwestern, northwestern, and northeastern astral projectors. 
I gotta wonder, are you still loyal to Ajara? Because, you know, there's a whole plot line with Ajara and Sylvanas in 8.2? 7.2? Which patch are we on? Right, Emony, the Slaughter Daughter. What name? Aerial advantage. Garmel's rocks dominate the skies above, striking out our forces as we advance. The Zeria Crease can't get out into position until they are cleared out. Can't get into position until they are cleared out. I would take care of them myself, but I'm not much of a flyer. Don't have the balance for it. Take my riding hook and lodge, lo latch onto a rock. Once you're riding, just start hitting it till the job's done. Grapple six battle zone rocks out of the sky. Ooh. Let's do this. Whoa. Am I... I'm not controlling it. Okay. Riding hook, rank of rock. Spare rock. I don't know what I'm doing to this. What am I doing? To leap to there. Use the riding hook to escape. Oh, I see. You need to panic it. I'm going really out of bounds here. Can I get back to the area? Well, that's a thing. <laughs> that's a learning curve. Uh huh. Uh huh. So let's see, projector. Right, that's one down. What's this? Oh, oh, I see. It's pointing me towards these. Can I get up? No, that's out of range. Well, never mind then. Light Arctiste. There's the Northwestern. Sindane? Can I go near this? Yeah, it's not going to attack me. Sindane. Hmm. Alright, they've got some kind of plan going around here. So I can charge a wind blade for you guys then. It'll be 5%, but I can. Okay. How about you guys? So from 5% to 13%, okay, percent, this is much better. Although that's 5%, so... Eh, debatable. And that's 6%. Yeah, it really is debatable about which is better. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, 32. That's gonna take a while. Uh-huh. Alright, Balsoon Rock. Let's see. It's panicking. Use the hook to escape. Ah, uh, so when it gets to... Uh, how many stacks? Six. It gets to six stacks. Okay. Four... Five. Uh. You, 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 you. There we go. Boom. Boom. And use. And this will be the final one, so I can just parachute down.
if it didn't bring me over there. <sighs> okay. Mission complete, at least. <laughs> ay, 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 what a dumb parachute mechanic. Let's see, 68%. Okay. Let's see, that's you. You guys. See these up, and let's just kill these quickly, I hope. That's 45. Now for you two. And my bomb. 55. Slowly but surely charging it. I gotta wonder if it is the same moon blade that I used in the in the Maldraxxus quest line. Because if so, hmm, would you be able to get as an actual weapon if you went through the Covenant campaign? Possibly. Yeah, that's a forward. Hmm. Getting a lot of greens. So let's see, there's you. And you're an elite. You're fine, you're gonna be killed by him. Let's get credit for both! Where's he going? <laughs> Unless he didn't want to fight it. Yeah, that's a possibility. Oh no, he is attacking it. Hmm. I am confused. That confuses me. Oh well. Wait, what do you mean that doesn't count? Son of a... How are you? No. How are you? No. Okay, I'm confused. What What gives me a percentage and what doesn't? That should. That's dumb. Okay, back to fighting you two. I will. I'll get the remaining 8% from you two and then I'll be done with this section. Woo. Can I please kill this weird Garmel guy? He's, he's weird. And boom. Lovely. And then let's hand in yours. I could hear their cries from here. Nice work. Why, thank you. Vosh. Garmel's influence runs deep in this place, but it will fade more quickly thanks to your efforts. Lovely. This is a long shot, but it might just work. Or just might work. The power of the Chosen. The Zera Crease is nearly in position. Now is the time to strike. We must force Garmel into the open together. Join me on my rock, and we will unleash your Runeblade's power on the Juggernauts. The Margrave will be unable to ignore their deaths. Once he leaves his blighted tower, we can finish him once and for all. Destroy the, blo the bile bloat juggernaut. I am ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. So, do I have a button I can use? What am I doing? There it is. Might of the Chosen. Ooh. That is a powerful blade. Hear me, Chosen. Hear me, Kyrian. The time for our final assault is at hand. Nice. My blade is Such ready. power. Gormel will have no choice but to face us now. The end is now. Our forces have control of the House of Constructs, thanks to your intervention. Now all that remains is the fall of the instigator themselves, Margrave Garmal. This battle has been long in the making, Marishna. I am at your side without hesitation. 
Let us go to this monster. We will join Zandria to see him slain. Meet with Zandria near the central chamber of the House of Constructs. Okie dokie. So I'm not, I'm not getting a uh, flight here, am I? Now, and yeah, Alexandros is following me. All right, so I guess a little RP section. Okay, the Kirin are there. I assume he's in the middle where Cookie was. No, he's still up there. Okay. Hello, Zandria. I have been ready since they sacked my temple. Nice. For the it is time. It is the way. Ooh. You already said that. Anyway, pursuit of justice. Draca stands ready to unleash the power of the Zeraki Zeracris upon Gormel. We need only buy her time to focus its weapon. What we do now, we do for all of us. Bastion and Madraxus have both lost many to these fiends. He will not be defeated easily, but united, our forces will finally bring him to justice. Defeat Margrave Garmel, and for that, I get shoulders. Which, honestly, are just... They're kind of dumb, if I'm honest. They're kind of dumb. Eh, what are you going to do? So, Margrave Garmel... The Margrave must be stopped once and for all. Always Let's do this. I'm ready to assist you. Let's do the shit. How does he even move? Give up this madness. The premise would not stand for this. We should have waited Bastion ages ago. The prime held us back. Uh oh. Your betrayal sealed your huh. fate. Justice will be done. I guess I'm helping uh Mograine for this. Yeah, I guess we're not actually fighting Garmel. Ah, just like every, just like every blue raid, we don't fight the actual big guy. We fight something else, and then the main hero of the story are the actual NPCs. Yeah, yeah. You had your chance to surrender. Now we will avenge Crexus with your blood. Crexus was a fool. Oh, can I attack it now? No. Ooh. Don't piss off an orc. And really, Draka didn't beg to join Chosen. She was just kind of given an invite from the letter. Uh, I should probably use my cooldowns. Yeah. Let me check. That dies. Oh, cutscene time! Huh. We were able to do that? I really hope I get to do that in the Necrolord campaign. 
Well, I guess he's dead. Can't even clip, click on his corpse. What do you need? Oh well. Welcome, brave Our fallen may finally rest in peace. Take heart. Mograine and I spoke at length when he visited Bastion. He suggests that should we manage to kill Garmel, his heart could be used to empower the Crest of Ascension. The Margrave bears the shape... <laughs> the shape? The Margrave bears the power to shape form in ways a few beings can. Though his results are grim, if we could harness that power, our Ascended would be stronger than ever before. It is not our way, but our way is changing, I think. Perhaps this is a step on our new path. Collect the Flesh Shaper's heart. Xandria, I implore you to take Garmel's heart. It is a grim task, but it carries his gift of shaping flesh. Its power would enhance your nascent crest of ascension. I thank you. I will see it done. Are you cutting him in half? Oh. Well, that's a thing. Are you sure we want this back in our base? Isn't there a way to purify it? It's creepy. Ay ay ay. Couldn't you have picked it up yourself? It must be done. I am relieved that I am not the one to carry that thing back to Bastion. You lazy! Ay, ay, ay. Return to the hold. Let us ferry the heart to Elysian Hold swiftly. There are many in the Shadowlands who would strike at us to take its power for their own. Keep your eyes open, more Walker. We return to our kin victorious this day. Meet Zandria at the Crest of Ascension in Elysian Hold in Bastion. Meet me in Elysian Hold. We shall place the heart together. Okie dokie. Lead the way, Baroness. I can say, what are you guys gonna do now? Are you just gonna fade out of existence? Any of a dialogue? No? No dialogue? I was hoping for some extra dialogue. Yeah well, so that's one more grave killed. Two were killed by the assholes. One was killed and replaced with another asshole. So there's two remaining bad Margraves out there, right? Well, at least according to this. Yeah, they're fading out of they're fading out of existence. So who knows? Maybe the other two will be dealt with in the other Covenant campaigns. Would be nice to see. Let me get comfy in my chair. Yeah, I suppose I'll find out when I go through them. Would be nice to see that story come to a conclusion. Okay, so we're we're really placing this, aren't we? It seems like a terrible idea. Alright. Welcome, brave soul. I am glad to be among our own once more. Maldraxxus is not to my tastes. Quest of Greatness. Once you're ready, all you must do is place the heart within the sphere here on the Quest of Ascension. Mechanicos' handiwork will ensure that its energy is channeled properly to aid in our Ascension rituals, and its power should help protect the Quest against any further attack. May the House of Constructs never set foot in our realm again. Place the flesh shaper's heart in the crest of ascension. The honor is yours, Morwalker. Yeah, the honor is mine, and you say. For your role in our victory against Garmor. Well, well, let's do this then. This looks to be the orb Xandria directed you to place the heart in. The flesh shaper's heart fits readily into that glowing sphere. As it enters, you hear faint clicking sounds within the crest as if it were designed to accept such power readily. Thus begins a new area, <laughs> area, area, I wish, new era for the Kyrian. Already I feel the crest's power 
are grown. New Ascended will be pivotal against Lysonia and Uther. We should seek further enhancements from the other Covenant's realms. I will discuss the matter with Adrestes. Go in service, Moorwalker. Okay. So I got a man from getting renowned 39. Very nice. Very nice. So let's see. I'm uh, one away from being max. So let's see. There's. Let me count. One, two, three. Okay, so we need one from Modern Wheel, then we need one from. How can I forget what the belief place is called? From Ravendraff. Ay, ay, ay. So I guess I'm starting the next episode of you guys over here. Where I will be doing assistance from Sinful. Lovely. Now I guess before I do that, it's time to do a couple of upgrades. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So it's over here, right? No, that's a quartermaster. It's over here. Yeah, armor smith and upgrade. How can I be of service? Let's see. Boom, 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 boom. A worthy exchange. Please take your time. So let's see. Let's bring this down there. I can upgrade you to one seven one for a hundred anima. After do the next chapter, I can get you up to one seven one. Can get you up to one seven one. And you. And you will be next. Okay. So let's see. No. 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 <laughs> Uh, I wasn't expecting any to replace the gear I had, but they will eventually grow in power to where they can. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So I guess I should end this video here. Uh-huh. So, this has been Dragon of Tony going through more World of Warcraft Shadowlands. In this video, I went through the Righteous Retribution chapter in the Kyrian campaign. In the next video, I'll be going through the Seal of Contrition chapter in the Kyrian campaign. So, if that planned out, viewers, with my rambling hopefully now done. If I can get a good outro image here, there we go. So, yeah. With all that said, viewers, my rambling hopefully now finally done. Until next time.